Hello party people! My name is Kyle Stolk. Welcome to this week's newest vlog of Stolk. 7 o'clock Friday evening. We're here again. Before we begin, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe here under. Help Guy out. And let's go! So this week on the planning, we are heading to Norway for a competition. Uh, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. We're racing the 50, 100, 200, 300, 200, medley, and maybe a few relays. Bags packed, heading to the bus. And it should be fun. Going with quite a big group. And uh, I'll take you guys with me. So enjoy. So for the rest of the week, it's been kind of crappy. Last weekend, we had a competition in uh, Aachen in Germany. And it was the last qualifying competition for the World Championships. And unfortunately, I didn't qualify. Which sucks. It's really, really crap. 1200s, I miss out on an individual time to qualify and a relay has been chosen but for the mixed relay and I'm the third guy on the 53 by 700s so I'm missing out on going to the world championship short course coming December by 700s which is shit, it sucks but shit happens, it's top score ups, downs Carry on from here. So we've made our way to uh, Norway, we're in Kristianstad for uh, the North Sea Swim Meet. Three day competition, short course, just racing, having fun. Um, yeah, that's about it. So this morning I had the 200 medley and 53 combi straight after each other. Went pretty well, into both the finals. So out now getting some fresh air, go get some food, and then later the, and then later the, the finals. So it should be fun. And thumbs up and we'll hope for the best, fingers crossed. Oof. That's one thing, that the Dutch, they say uh, where they're like thumbing for you, the diamond for you, when they mean like how in English, fingers crossed. So I was like, good luck. And for us it's like, fingers crossed. That's kind of a small little change in words. So we got in yesterday, we've seen nothing of the city. We've got a, today, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, we've got competition and then Monday morning we leave again. So probably won't see much. So what we do see is pretty beautiful and to be honest it's kind of giving me like whoa I'd want to live in Norway just for like say so you've got this beautiful view there and so you think like there water there like later I want to live somewhere close to water so this is ideal only it's a little it's a little gray a little overcast it rains a lot in Norway so that might be a, a minus a, a con but yeah, so we're here for the competition, and if you look carefully, that is our hotel, and that is the pool, and we actually don't have to leave our building to go to the pool. Second floor, we can walk straight into the pool, it takes us about three minutes, and we're there. So that's great, because you don't want to go outside in this weather, though I do feel claustrophobic, so I'm going for a nice little walk, see the scenery, see the sights and enjoy the little bit of Norway that we can. Yeah.
This is where I'd want my future house. This view, some grass on. So day two, just about ready for the finals. Uh, so far going pretty decent. Uh, won the 200 medal yesterday, so nice little gold medal there and some uh, cash bonus, always good. Um, 53, also decent, nothing spectacular. Um, for these next few days, my roomie, the one and only, Ben Schreiter. He's not here at the moment, he's just gone to the pool. And I'm on my way there now. 100 free final. And a relay, should be fun, and I'll keep you guys posted. As swimmers, we have to do dry land trainings in all sorts of places. Key is to improvise, adapt, overcome. Time for a dry land. So, two wins again tonight, 100 free, 47-2, and a relay win, some nice little medals, got a new towel, yeah, this is what you do it for, and up a bed, good night. So my roomie, for the past few days, the one and only, Ben Schwietert. Hello. <laughs> ben is not also only an incredible swimmer, he was voted <laughs> in 2016 by the Vogue magazine that Holland's hottest Olympian Dutch Vogue number one Ben Schwietert <laughs> not only is he good looking he also has the brains he studies at the university trigonometry <laughs> good looking smart great bod ladies if you're single, contact Ben Schreiterth. <laughs> so, it's uh, been a pretty decent composition here. Nothing spectacular. Um, kind of everything above PB. Um, four individual goals. Woo! So that's nice. Four new towels. There they are. Two blue, two white. Yeah, let's go. Um, a little PB in the 53, uh, 21-62, so in the last week it would have been good to uh, get into the World Championship team, so that kind of sucks, kind of like that I only did it now and not last week, so yeah, it's a little too late, it sucks, but yeah, it's part of the game and part of the sport, and yeah, shit happens. For now, uh, gonna go to bed, first go catch some Pokemon. And then relax. Tomorrow, training here in the morning. Take you guys with me. And then head back home. Ready for my own bed. It's uh, been a tough two weeks. So. Time to sleep. Sleep a lot. Bedtime. Hey, Brazilian! Oh, no. 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 Oh, 
I saw the film. It's so probably one of the like least motivated swim trainings ever. We made it through. Bags are packed. Ready to head home. Been a pretty good time here in uh, Christian South. I'd love to come back next year, so hopefully come back uh, race again and uh, enjoy the Norwegian scenery. Seen barely anything of the city. It's worth it. Yeah. Hey Ben. Hey.